hello friends today we are going to discuss projection of plane problem third type what is the given data for that problem the given data is a plate having a shape of an isosceles triangle isosceles triangle is given to you the plane given to you is a isosceles triangle having side of base 50 एम एम एंड अल्टीट्यूड इज गिवन टू यू सेवेंटी एम एम इट इज सो प्लेस दैट इन फ्रंट व्यू इट इज सीन एज एन इक्विलेटर ट्राइंगल फ्रंट व्यू इज अ इक्विलेटर ट्राइंगल फिफ्टी एम एम साइड and this side is inclined to hp by 45 degree draw the projections of the plate so this is a third type of problem the given data is a plane is given to you reduced shape is given to you and one inclination is given to you as the reduced shape is appearing in front view it means that the plane is inclined to vp if and only if the plane is inclined to vp then we will get a reduced shape in the front view so first step is what you have to draw a reference line then from which we are going to from which view we are going to start the uh, we are going to start from the uh, on the view which is appearing on the plane to which it is inclined here the plane is inclined to vp and so we are going to start from the view appearing on the vp plane that is front view so in front view draw isosceles triangle ab is given to you 50 mm initially you have to draw ab perpendicular to xy of 50 mm side a dash b dash because front view is denoted by small letter with a dash then locate the midpoint of ab from that draw a horizontal line length of this horizontal line is equal to altitude of the triangle the altitude of the triangle is given to you 70 mm so draw 70 mm this is c dash point join a dash b dash and c dash this is the front view of the equilateral triangle then take the projections in the downward direction here we are going to draw the top view of this plane below reference line as nothing lies in the vp so draw this this point is ab this point is c in the second stage generally we used to take the surface inclination but here surface inclination is not given to you instead of that a reduced shape is given to you so we are keeping this shape for the for a while and we are going to draw the reduced shape in the front view the reduced shape is a equilateral triangle of 50 mm side so draw perpendicular line here on that projection this this point is a1 dash this is b1 dash then take a1 dash b1 dash this distance in your compass a1 dash at the center cut arc here b1 dash at the center cut arc and you will get the c1 dash point this is a reduced shape equilateral triangle in the front view then take projections in the downward direction take projection of previous top view this point is a1 b1 then take projection of c1 dash in the downward direction then take this much distance ac distance in your compass a1 dash at the center cut arc on that projector from c1 dash this point is c1 and a1c1 is the inclination of the plane with a vp you have to measure this inclination that is phi and write down below the solution the plane is inclined to vp by this much angle then last stage is what the side of the equilateral triangle is inclined to hp by 45 degree we know that inclination with the hp is always always seen in front view so draw a line inclined at angle of 45 degree then on this line we are we are going to redraw this diagram second stage front view 
only difference is that a1 dash b1 dash here perpendicular to xy here we are making inclined to xy mark this point at approximate distance this point is b2 dash then take b1 dash a1 dash b2 dash as a center this point is a2 dash then take 50 mm distance and cut arc you will get c2 dash point so here we have drawn the second stage top view making the one side of the equilateral triangle that is AB side inclined to XY by 45 degree. Then take the projections in the downward direction. This is projector for B. So this point is B2. Then projector for A. This point is A2. Then take projector for C2 dash. This point is C2. Join all the points by proper sequence. So this is a reduce, uh, this is a final stage top view and final stage front view. Now we are going to discuss the second problem of same type, type number 3. Here the given data is a rectangle is given to you, AB is 60 mm, BC is 80 mm, length AB is equal to 60 mm, length BC is equal to 80 mm, AB is on HP. AB on HP means what? The front of the AB will be on reference line. So you have to take that side perpendicular to XY in the top view. And BC is 30 degree inclined to VP. Inclination means VP is denoted by phi. So phi is 30 degree. Draw the projections of the plate. If top view of a rectangle is a square. Here we are getting in the previous problem. We are getting the front view as a reduced shape. Means it is inclined to VP. Here in the second problem, it is given that the top view is a reduced shape. So the plate is inclined to, the rectangle is inclined to HP. And if a rectangle is inclined to HP, we are going to start from the view appearing on the HP plane. That is the top view. In the top view, you have to draw a rectangle by taking AB side perpendicular to XY. AB is 60 mm. BC is 80 mm. So draw a rectangle ABCD. AB C D where A B is 60 mm and B C is 80 mm then take the projections in the upward direction we have to draw the front view of this rectangle on a reference line because A B is on H P so we are going to assume that the complete plane is in HP. Then the, again same in the second stage we used to take the surface inclination but here surface inclination is not given to you. Instead of that it is given that top view is a square. So we are skipping the surface inclination for a while. Instead of that we are drawing the reduced shape in the top view by taking the projection of the previous stage top view. Here we want to draw a square of 60 mm. So take the projection and complete the square of 60 mm this is a1 b1 c1 and d1 then take projection in the upward direction this point is a1 dash b1 dash then take the projection of c1 d1 in the upward direction then take this a distance that is a dash c dash a distance in your compass a1 dash as a center cut r this point is c1 dash d1 dash and this is the required inclination of the plate with the hp that is this inclination is theta you have to measure this inclination and write down below the solution that the plate is inclined to hp by this much angle in the last stage we used to take the inclination of the edge or side here bc side is inclined to vp by 30 degree so draw a line incline at angle of 30 degree we are going to take the inclination of the BC. So in the previous stage top view, you have to see the length of the that BC. If the BC is original length, then no need to take apparent angle. But if you observe that, here we are getting the reduced shape of the BC, reduced length of the BC. So here you have to take the apparent angle. How we are going to take the apparent angle? Please see carefully. First mark here one point on this 30 degree line. That point is B2 dash. Sorry, that point is B2 then 
take original length of BC from the first stage top view that is ATMM in your compost, B2 as a center, cut arc here, no need to give the name to this point, then from that point draw a line draw a locus that is horizontal line then take reduce length that is b1 c1 in your compost b2 as a center cut arc so this point is c2 and on this new inclination this is apparent inclination as we are not getting the true length of bc in the previous here, uh, previous stage uh, top view here you have to take the apparent angle so we have taken the apparent angle this is a required apparent angle and on this new inclination you have to redraw this diagram here the second stage top view by drawing this perpendicular line then take b b1 a1 distance b2 at the center this point is a2 from a2 uh, then take c c1 d1 distance c2 at the center cut arc here this point is d2 so here you are getting the same second stage top view only difference is that here BC is perpendicular uh, B, uh, BC is parallel to XY here BC is inclined to XY because BC is inclined to VP by 30 degree then take projections in the upward direction this is for A this is for B then this is for C Take projections from previous front view this is for D so this point is a2 dash this is b2 dash this is c2 dash this is d2 dash join the points by proper sequence this is the final front view of the plane this is the second stage, uh, this is the third type of the problem where the given data is a plane is given to you, reduced shape is given to you and one inclination is given to you. I hope that you will like this. Don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. Thank you.